Please say a command. Call Skylar. Calling Skylar on cell. No. <laughs> Don't sound so excited, buddy. Well, of course I'm excited talking to you. Hey, good morning, everybody. Just getting ready to go work some more ground today. I got Skylar grabbing the 320, the tire tractor. He's going to bring it back over. He's done beating stubble. I'm going to put it back on that DMI, this ripper. I don't mind working with the T, but uh, it tears up my ends a lot more, makes berms. And then we're going to have to smooth it out so when I plant next year with the tail planter, I don't have rough ends. But Anyways, just grabbing some fuel, and then we'll head back over, get the tractors warmed up, ready to go. I guess it'd probably be a good idea to go check on the cellar, make sure everything's good there this morning. I, um, Phil's been checking it. I haven't checked it for a while. While I'm over here, might as well check it before I go get in the tractor. Why not? This is one that we rent. It's not ours. It's an older seller, but yeah, it works. Turns look good. Burbanks. Narcotas. Looks like the storm pretty good. Not bad. Well, Phil just called, said the 320, the fan hub. No, there's some clutches on the front to run that fan. And they're worn out on that. It's rattling really bad. He's worried about it coming apart. We've had problems with the fan on this tractor up here. It ended up coming apart, doing a bunch of damage to the radiator. We had to put a new radiator in it. Um, some plastic shrouding, I think, broke. I can't remember everything, but. I think those are the main parts. So he called Deer. They have a fan hub, so we can put in the 320. I'm just gonna unhook this. So let Skyler go start chisel plowing with this. First, Skyler's gonna run in, go grab that fan hub, come back out, bring that fan hub to me. I'm gonna put the fan hub in that 320 and bring it over here in DMI. Skyler's gonna take the T here, go and chisel plow the field that he just double beam. Make sense? Good. Listen to that John Deere run now. No clink clink, clink 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 clink, clunk clunk clunk. Wish I had some footage of it uh, doing it. it. Sounds a lot better now. It was pretty rattly. We're just letting it, uh, trying to warm it up, make sure we got all the air out of the system so we can go put it back to work. New fan hub right there. I don't know where the old junker got put. Oh, Phil put it in the box. Here's the old clunker. And it's down in here, the pins, and the slide in here. This is clunking back and forth on the shaft. I didn't want to take it apart. No point in taking it apart. I'm not saving anything from that, so. Oh well. Ah, feels good to be back home. By home, I mean my tractor home. Not my real office. 
I think it's going to be anything like this. Well, 320. Oh, how I've missed you. I don't know why I prefer this so much over the TI. I really don't. The T pole's better. Has more horsepower. I mean, by all regards, I should like the T more, but something about about 320 just speaks to me. Man, I miss the craw. It is fun to watch it back there. Phillips over there hooking it up to uh, that weird looking red tractor. I don't want to pay for it though, so we'll stick with this one. And there we go. There's Philip hooking up the red tractor back to the craw. gonna miss it. Part of the deal with them is we've got to take it back to the shop, spray it off, wash it up a little bit. Um, we really like it. It's something that uh, we wish we had the money for right at the moment. We could definitely be using it. It'd be great to have at the moment, but uh, we've had enough expenses this year, just not really in the budget. But hopefully, maybe next year, things will work out and we can pick one up. Really help our uh, fall production getting groundwork done. Everyone that runs one, I've only heard good things about it, so definitely something on our want list. Once again, I want to say thank you to our local case dealer for bringing that out for us and the Lumpkin rep. We really are impressed with it. You will be missed. call it a day only got what 23 acres done not a whole lot but it's five o'clock I know it's not very late I got a lot to do but I want to take my wife out take the family out go grab something to eat probably get to go thought it was a good time to call it so we'll just park her here and leave her for Monday anyways thanks for watching please like and subscribe and we'll catch you guys later. Uh, he's, well, first, <laughs> sad day.